What's your favorite Beyonce album? Oh my gosh. And I'm going to see her on tour? Oh man, oh man. Hey y'all, it's Storm Reed here. Today we are playing Truth or Where? Where? 12 Years a Slave Los Angeles premiere. Oh, oh, I remember, I remember this look. I was wearing a gold dress that I had gotten from like Century City. I was obsessed with Hello Kitty. So I had my uh, cheetah print, <laughs> cheetah print Hello Kitty purse, my boots, my tights. Would I wear that look again? Absolutely. <laughs> Ooh, truth. <laughs> Who is your first celebrity crush? Justin Bieber. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. If I had to be stranded on a desert island with any of my past or current co-stars, who would it be and why? Oh, stranded? one of my co-stars, can we bring them all? I don't know, probably, uh, I think me and Z, me and Z would have a good time out there. So I'm just gonna bring my big sis along with me <laughs> to be stranded. <laughs> okay, where? Stage six in Screen Gems world premiere of Missing. Ah, oh, yes, I wore this gorgeous Balmain gown. It had like feathers and it was like, so delicate, so beautiful. Jason did an amazing job, my stylist, uh, helping me pick that outfit. I loved it, it was gorgeous. What's a fashion or beauty trend you wish would make a comeback? Ooh, I feel like a lot of like the, the old school beauty trends and fashion trends are coming back and everybody's loving them, especially on TikTok. But what I'm so glad did come back is, I'm actually wearing it right now, the lime lip with the lip gloss, the 90s lip, like I like to call it. Super cute. <laughs> okay, 2021 Met Gala in America, a lexicon of fashion. Yes, I wore custom Prada to my first ever Met Gala. I was so nervous. I had just chopped off my hair, dyed it blonde, but I was wearing that gorgeous gown. People thought it was a dress, but it was actually like a really tight corset and a beautiful skirt with beautiful pink feathers. I felt like a princess. The look was inspired by uh, many people, but specifically Lola Falana. I had the best time. Oh, my best memory from that night <laughs> was probably getting back to the hotel from the party and sitting on the floor and eating french fries. <laughs> it was like the first time that I had like, was able to take a deep breath that day. <laughs> but I had an um, amazing time at the party as well. Where? Okay, HBO's The Last of Us Los Angeles premiere. Ah, yes, what a fun look. It was custom Prada. Um, I just felt so, so amazing. I felt like a princess. I loved the blazer and then the, like, the skirt under it. Funny thing though, I tried that look on in a fitting and I was like, oh yeah, this is super cute. Oh, it's gonna be great. And I always like to be comfortable. Like, of course you gotta look good, but the rule of thumb for me is to be comfortable. I was comfortable, but the sequence like sliced my leg up. <laughs> so when I took the, the, the skirt off that night, I was like, why do I have all these scratches? And I was like, oh, it was the skirt. <laughs> super cute look though. <laughs> okay. Ooh, where? Mew Mew Fall Winter 2020 Show. Oh, yes, this is when I walked in the Mew Mew Show. I opened for Mew Mew. It was a dream come true. I was wearing like this beautiful, gorgeous, like copper, amber dress. I was so nervous. My feet were hurting so bad. I was a ball of nerves, but I had the best time. Truth or wear, truth, I got a truth. What's your favorite Beyonce album? Oh my gosh. And I'm going to see her on tour? Oh man, oh man. Okay, either her self-titled Beyonce album, I think just, uh, that was a great album, and Lemonade is a good album too. I really like Lemonade. <laughs> and great fashion looks in Lemonade as well. Truth. What is one thing about The Last of Us that you wouldn't know unless you were on set? 
everything is green screen. Like they paid so, so much attention to detail trying to replicate the video game, which I think they did an amazing job at, but it's all post-production. Other than like some greenery and some trees and some dirt, none of it is real, <laughs> but it looks real. So they did a good job. Um, last one, truth or wear. Let's see what we get. I got a truth. So inspired by your character June in Missing, who spends a lot of time on the internet, what's the last app you used on your phone? And what was the last thing I Googled? Oh, the last app I used on my phone was probably my text, my text message app, checking my text messages to make sure nobody is trying to get in contact with me. <laughs> um, and the last thing I Googled, I Googled to see if Insomnia Cookies was open. There's a cookie place on my campus. I was at a basketball game. I wanted a cookie and they were open. I got me a, a chocolate chip peanut butter cup cookie with a scoop of vanilla ice cream. It was fresh, it was warm. I had the best time.